Good morning, folks. Welcome, observers. Today, we've got three new science stories to break down. Planets, the sun, and climate. The ocean collapse centered in the Atlantic. And a bombshell on geodesy breaking down right now as Earth's magnetic field rounds the bend into the final stretch of the pole shift. We're watching the last 24 hours on our star here, and it was very quiet. Little pops off the sides, crackling near the central active region. Upper coronal waves seen near the small coronal hole. But no solar flares or eruptions, and the main reason things have stayed quiet is that there is only one sunspot group, the one we watched, pop up yesterday morning, but after a flurry of growth and spreading, now only the latter remains and the distending of the active region is loosening the magnetic complexity with which it was born. Heading to the articles, we've got Scafetta, one of the favorites over the last 15 years, once again coming in and demonstrating convincingly that the planetary positions and alignments work solar activity, sunspots, and Earth's climate cycles. He has demonstrated this in dozens of papers here in the 21st century. Up next, I found the story you were all talking about on the live show the other day. It wasn't actually a science study, which is why I nearly went mad looking for it in the journals. The government of Iceland reviewed the data and science on the Atlantic meridional overturning circulation collapse and determined, we're cooked, chat. National emergency declared, they are not wrong. Now, folks, I am over an hour late this morning, and you probably figured Ben was just being a little too Ben last night, and yeah, I was. But I'm late because I found this at the last second this morning, and it required a fairly deep dive. So, folks, there are core cycle patterns in the Earth rotation speed, the length of a day, and they are well known to be tied to geomagnetic activity in the Earth's magnetic field. So why would we be shocked that they are breaking down now? amidst the magnetic pole shift. The longer oscillation is broken down entirely already, and the shorter, stronger cycle is decaying. Kudos to the professor who got his three students directly involved in the science and then wrote the paper with them, but also a nice big, oh crap, at the thousandth revelation of the past decade of just how much our planet is breaking down in this disaster cycle. We've only got a few events left in the year at Observer Ranch, mostly fun family events, but those are when you guys get the most one-on-one -on -one time asking questions and hanging out. Tickets are about half gone for our major event next year. Roger Cunningham, Ethical Skeptic, and I are going to come together to drill down the pole shift details over five days. The textbook version of the PDF link is below as well, and so is the link to come to one of our winter tour events. The first one is just 11 days away in Omaha, Nebraska, the only central state's location in the group. Second one in San Diego, that's less than a month away. ObserverRanch.com to come see us. Links to the rest are also right down there below the video. We greatly appreciate your support, and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 7 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.